I'm gonna try to do this in one take. I know this video is gonna have a, a limited amount of people interested, but I'm a dentist and a lot of companies are trying to sell these fancy HEPA filter units that you put over the patient and they're about three grand and the idea is that they suck up any aerosol. Uh, most of them do no more than 300 CFM and that's like the airflow. So I figured, you know what? I can definitely build my own. <laughs> I can do it, man. No, I figured I can build my own. I, I dabble in woodworking. I like doing that stuff. So I put together some parts and I made Frankenstein over here and I'll show you. All right, so here's what we got. All right, so this is my version of a HEPA filter. Okay, so it's made out of solid, the door is solid cherry. It's just a regular, you know, like, this is like a kitchen cabinet on wheels. All right, so some of it is solid. Some of it is cherry uh, plywood. It's got a uh, on off speeds. It's got an eight inch inline duct fan that does about 700 CFM. The eight inches throttle down to six inches because this is a inline HVAC HEPA filter uh, with a MERV 11 pre-filter. Uh, all right, so this is a self-supporting flexible, flexible PVC duct. It's on, it's on wheels so I can roll it around. All right, so the idea, this is a six inch flexible PVC. It's, it's self-supporting, so you can kind of just leave it over the patient like this. Okay, so what I would do, what we would do is if we're doing something that generates aerosol, let's say, or a hygienist is doing a scaling or something with an ultrasonic scaler, you wheel it over, you plug it in. Let me plug it in and I'll show you how it works, okay? So I'm gonna test the HEPA filter that I, that I uh, built for my, off, for my dental office here. All right, let me bring it in. Let's see how it works over a patient, a fake patient. I use a little bit of smoke. Let's see what I can see in the video. Four. Speed number four. This is very lovely. 